Nick, tell him about the time you let you let me fuck a girl on your bed. Uh, probably top three biggest mistakes of my life. <laughs> yeah. That's like she started bleeding everywhere. Apparently. Yeah, oh, come on. <laughs> Some people call me the space you break your cowboy. neck, I got it on camera. <laughs> it's not even going to be close. It's going to be so overwhelming, uh, underwhelming because I'm going to clear it with... But where are you going to land, though? Right there? Saying. Listen, bro. You're going to land over Growing it? up in the fucking projects of uh, Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. Seriously. Getting, like, a, me and my friends practice parkour in the event we would have to be, like, running from something, you know? So <laughs> it's just way too easy. Let's you go. literally put your arms here and then you... Boost yourself up and swing your legs to the side and Shkugua. then land. Yeah. Shadukin. <laughs> Shadukin. Get out of my game. You're an anime dude. character, I'm I swear you, you are. We used to do that shit, we'd be sprinting, <laughs> hit the curb. Oosh. Nah, that was actually funny. Do it again. Do it again. There's another way to do it where, like, if you really try to get flashy with it, instead of putting your legs to the side, you go <laughs> up and put your legs through the middle, bro. Wow. <laughs> no, that was a crazy one. That's what I'm saying, bro. Me and you, bro. Bear coming after us. I'm the one surviving. You are. I'm, you I'm are, over that. Yeah, you are. We need a shotgun that. right now. <laughs> shotgun. Because I'm, yes, I'm, I'm behind you on that, Come dude. Come on, bro. <laughs> dude, bro. If I was sprinting at be this. Post, you'll be posted up right here on the curb with the camera, and I'm some, right below you like this, bro. Oh, my Bear God. Bear coming at us as soon as it goes like Boom. this. And we'd catch it on camera, too. That's the craziest yeah, thing. You'll be the craziest shit, We killed bro. a bear, bro. Wow. Come on. Wow. Needless to say, it's a vibe. Dude, imagine like 42 <laughs> years old, we go on like a camping trip, and that's literally what ends up being a vlog. Dude, that's literally going to be a vlog at 42. Actually, that's going to be vlog number 3072. Oh I'm calling God. it now, bro. <laughs> There's a lot of people that watch the videos. Okay. And they're young people. They're like 14. Young people. Young people. We're, okay, whatever. What? Young people watch the video. Like oh, 14. Oh, you're saying that like, oh. Let me shut up. No, no, please <laughs> shut up. I think it would be great for them to get a perspective on, on some things in life mm -hmm. from a girl like you. You know, you've experienced a lot. You're an immigrant. You're, you're like an athlete. You're, you're so much, you know, and, mm -hmm. and you're actually really smart, which is surprising to some people because they, they think you're stupid, you know? <laughs> Before, no. It's crazy. There was once when we were going back to Charlotte mm -hmm. from Washington, me and Ferris, we were, we were talking, but we were hugging, and <laughs> I remember this guy just did so weird. He was just doing some weird shit. And me and Ferris looked at it together. Like, nobody else was watching. But me and him were looking at it, and we straight up started laughing for hours. Like, at the airport, laughing. She's also a terrible storyteller. What's your advice to people that kind of want to do the same things you're doing? Well, I think, like, everything just takes dedication, to be honest. Mm -hmm. That's, like, something that I say a lot about. That's why my parents said to me all the time like you can't you really can't do much if you don't focus in your goal and if you don't have dedication to it because if you're doing something that you don't like then you're just not gonna do it yeah you're just going to not go to class <laughs> you're but not you, gonna but you didn't come to class today. <laughs> well, I was like last appointment okay yeah okay. Um, you actually haven't been to the last two classes um yeah. Oh, yeah. Because I was in a car accident. I was still getting... You know what? I'm not going to have this conversation with you. Okay. You know, whatever. Almost <sighs> caught you in the action. Almost. Boys, Nicholas is back to his Clemson apartment. Look at this place. Nick, tell him about the time you let you let me fuck a girl on your bed. Uh, Probably top three biggest mistakes of my life. <laughs> yeah. That's like, she started bleeding everywhere. Apparently. Yeah, oh, come on. Right, and he was like... Back it up a little bit. There's some girl that he matched with on Tinder, and he's like, yo, I'm only here for one night. Like, disgusting. come on over. You look jacked, by the way. Yeah, Jeez. I mean, you already know. Yo, so. come on. <laughs> we know uh, what the presence of Mr. Rucker does long. I swear. Too much protein. Anyways, I matched with this girl on Tinder, you know. I was at a low point in my life. Anyways, she came over. I was like, Nick, bro, please, like, let me use your room to, like... Mr. Brookner wouldn't let it happen. Yeah, Mr. Brookner did not want to, so Nick was like, bet, I'll sacrifice. And then I was like, okay, bet. And they left the apartment, so we were fucking. It was crazy. It was crazy. Yeah, they were going um, to town. Somehow, Monte walks in with a with a recording and puts it on the table so we could hear the sounds of Mr. Uh, Ferreira. Just, just fucked up, right? Yeah. <laughs> it was insanely it was bad, insane. but whatever. They heard me moaning and everything. Anyways, yeah. uh... And then I, we literally saw... We get on the elevator, and we see them, like, while we literally walk by... Mr. Ferreira, because he's like, I'm going to bring you back to your car after he was done giving her, like, bang, bang, 3,000. <laughs> and so once he did that, we, like, yeah. saw him walk into my room. You know, I'm looking there. I'm like, wow, like, he did a lot of work here. And I'm like, why is there so much blood? Because uh, this is crazy. This is not his bed. She was bleeding crazy. And I, I was like, dude, this, I told her, I was like, this is my roommate's bed. And she was like, it's over. I miss her, actually. Her name's if you're out there and you're seeing this, reach out to me again because you forgot to answer my last five texts. Yeah. <laughs> Did she start like crying or something? Nah. Like, trying to tell you about her life story and how depressing yeah. her life is. And then well, like, like, 
have fun, good night. Yeah. Well, like, she came in the car and she was upset. Like, I could see her, she was upset. And I was like, I'm not about to fuck this girl that's just, like, depressed as fuck. So I was like, tell me about, like, what's going on. Oh, yeah. You <laughs> so, <laughs> sat down, like, just some random Tinder girl you just met. Uh, so we, we, we connected, dude. We connected. And I mean, now, hey, I respect her. Like last time I, I, I hit her up when I was here, she was like, "Hi, it's been so long." Like it was a good, it was a good, you know, it was a good interaction. Sour. Yeah. I'm okay. at Hunting trip bro. with the boys. <laughs> Dude, imagine if, if, if you actually were editing the video and you had this footage from there, bro, you'd, you'd, you'd be doing that on your Apple Vision Pro. She 